Von Randy here, and I'm going to show you how to download and install the CoursePlay developer version. So first off, we got to go to the uh, GitHub for the CoursePlay, and I'll put a link for this in the description below. Uh, once we're on the GitHub for CoursePlay, we're just going to click on the clone or download, download as zip. I'm just going to save this to the desktop here for the moment. And there it showed up up there, so we'll just get rid of that. Okay, so you now have the course play in a zip. I may be thinking, great, we'll just uh, drop this into my mod folder and I'll be done. Not quite so fast. Uh, going back to my uh, tutorial on how to install mods, if you remember, I said one very important thing there. Make sure you open it up and look for the XML, the mod descript XML. And if you notice, there is not one in here. The only thing in here is a folder. So if we open up the folder, now you can see there's the mod descript XML. So what we actually need to do here, we're just going to extract this. And I have WinRAR installed, but if you don't have WinRAR, you can just use the extract all up here. And no, I don't need to see it when it's extracted. We'll uh, open that up in a moment. Okay, so now we have it extracted. Open it up, go into the folder here, and what we're simply going to do is select all. And for that, I can click up here or Control A. Control A will select them all as well. And then I'm just going to right click on any one of the files here, and we're going to add it to an archive, or you can send to zip. In my case, for some reason on my computer, the uh, send to a compressed zip folder option does not work on my computer. It just throws an error. So I actually have to use the add to archive using WinRER. Uh, select format zip. And there we go. Now it's Course Play Master. Now, if you open up this zip folder, you will look and see there's the mod script. Like I was saying, you need to make sure you open up your mods and double check and make sure you see that mod script file. If you do not see it, Something is wrong. Now, one thing I'm going to do here, as course play always comes as a ZZ course play, I'm actually going to rename this. I don't know that you actually have to do this or not, but in the past with released versions, this was always the uh, file name, so I've always kept that file name. Now, all I need to do, drag this over to my mod folder, which I have open in the background here. That's uh, what this is, by the way. This is the Farming Simulator 17 mod folder drag this over drop it in and then replace the file in the destination now in this case i'm not going to do this but uh, normally you would just click yes or if you don't already have it obviously it won't actually ask you this at that point you should have course play installed and like i said this is the course play developer version this requires that little extra step there you can't just drop this course play master in because the mod descript is not here actually buried one folder deep. I don't know if there's a reason if that's a GitHub thing or what does that, but you do need to make sure you open it up, extract it, then actually zip all the files that are here into a zip and move that to your mod folder. So hopefully that uh, answers anybody's questions for how to install the developer version of CoursePlay. As always, thanks for watching and till next time.